Hey everyone, and welcome to day 16 of my horror movie review marathon, and I've got your Drag Me to Hell movie review. A woman gets a curse put on her that will send her to hell. Can she fight off this demon and save her soul? So as far as the story goes, Sam Raimi directs this horror film that I have now seen for the first time. While at first things are not so perfect for this one woman at her job, and dealing with her boyfriend's parents, she meets this woman who she turns away helping, and then things start to hit the fan. It felt like your typical horror movie, where it's a race against time and many obstacles can get in the way, but in the most inconvenient way possible. Now that I've looked into some theories about the truth about this movie, I believe it has a method to her madness and a reason for all of this happening. Could this woman have an eating disorder and all this stuff is just in her head? It's an interesting theory that I'm kind of convinced is the truth, but you guys can be the judge and let me know what your thoughts are. So as far as the casting goes, you've got Alison Lohman who plays this one woman who I feel like is portrayed by your typical actress in a horror movie, and I wouldn't necessarily say she had the best acting in this movie, but it was just okay with what she had to deal with. Now, Justin Long is her boyfriend in this movie, and we've seen him before in horror movies like Jeepers Creepers, but he really didn't add much depth to the overall film. Now, that one old woman in this movie was just scary as hell, pun intended. She was absolutely creepy to watch, and I think she's one of the scariest antagonists I've ever seen. And you've also got that dude from Inception, who could just give this one chick her sedative instead of reading her poem. Just saying. So the things that I liked about this movie was that, like I said, it is scary at times. And a lot of stuff is definitely going on in this movie that will surely give me nightmares. I felt like gagging at one point, probably because projectiles are flying everywhere throughout this movie. It was gruesome and sometimes over the top. I screamed at least once or twice, to be honest. But unfortunately, the things that I didn't really like about this movie was that some of the special effects felt cheesy. It really took me out of the film, especially once the third act comes on. And that was just weird with all of these added silly moments that felt unnecessary and don't even get me started on how this movie ended. So overall, I would say The Drag Me to Hell just, it's a weird, creepy movie that I was surprised that the director of Spider-Man conjured up. So I'm unsure if I want to recommend this movie to anyone, but you guys can see it if you want. You've just been warned. So I would give this two and a half hearts on the heart rate scale. So let me know in the comments what you guys thought of Drag Me to Hell, and come back tomorrow for day 17 of my horror movie review marathon. And as always, you guys can subscribe to my channel, I've got more movie reviews, movie updates, come back every week for a Thursday video. You guys can also like me on Facebook and follow me on Twitter, and I will see you guys later.